Here we are. Now we're live, Shadow. Hi. Miss Peggy's here. Hello. Stream oh, yeah. usually takes a second, I noticed lately. They'll pop in. This is going to be a simple live tonight, guys. It's going to... Um, the craft I have, I'm thinking, because it's not how I wanted to do it. So what I thought we'd do is I got everything in for the surprise treehouse. So I thought we'd be... Uh, go over what we have, what we need, and plan it out with Shadow. And Dom is there. Peggy, if you want to come on and help, let me know. You can. And um, we're just making up plans for the help tree house. So I thought this way, if you pop in, if not, you can come back and watch the video, and you'll know what we have for the house. And then probably in another week or two, we'll start getting it together. So we'll chit chat, have fun, and plan, and I'll show you what we have. Sounds good, right? Like shadow. I'm looking yeah. at Peggy's name and saying it's a shadow. Yeah, sounds good. So, oh, wait for a few more people. Dan, I don't know if Dan's gonna be here. Dan, maybe I should have listened to my messages. Then if you talk to Dan. Yeah, send her the link. Kimmy, so she can pop in. Okay. I'm coming to get you, Peggy. Hold on. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. Email. Come on. What did it do? Oh no. Hold on. I copied the wrong thing. Kimmy, how dare you? It's on its way. Coming. <laughs> I'm goofy today, guys. It's been muggy here. We had a huge storm today. It downpoured this morning and I had to leave and it flooded everywhere for an hour and a half. And then all of a sudden sunshine came out, all the running water, except for a couple spots, gone. Like it never happened. So, I, I, what? I'm sorry. Oh, I'm like, I'm not saying that, Lisa. I think she was. <laughs> I'm You're not late. I'm like, I'm not saying that, Lisa. I'm not Hi, sure Peggy. my notification went out Sorry. today. I think I said it late. I'm I don't know. Not I'm like, I'm not but the way, I'm, like I said, I'm, I'm Lisa, Lisa and we're just gonna chill today, Peggy. Yes. I got the cutest things in. I got to show you. Are you gonna hey. So, when they pop in, whatever, it could be a replay. So, well, I'm gonna retitle it anyways. And as they pop in, if people have thoughts and ideas, they can tell me. Um, Are you sending me a present, Lisa Ann? I've been trying to pack boxes. Eyeshadow. shadow. Do you mean hi? <laughs> she keeps missing. She keeps tricking me. It, the other one I think meant to say, oh, you know. Lisa's shadow and Peggy tonight. <laughs> Maybe. Oh, cool. <laughs> they pop in slow. So, I kind of made a mess here. Look at this. Barely they should full screen it so you could see them. Yeah, ladies' night. <laughs> so far, gonna... anyway. <laughs> yeah. Oh, look at that. Isn't that cool? That is so cool. I need some little amethyst chips on top of it. <laughs> oh, now I gotta bling it out. Well, I could. That would be funny. And then stick a stick a little tiny spear in its mouth. 
Ah, oh, I have one. I That's have what one. Robbie did <laughs> with that one. He has oh. on his desk. Okay. Or wherever you put it now. <laughs> but did, I think he just did the top, right? Yeah, they just did the top. Yeah. Well, now we have a mini one. <laughs> so. And then I think Shadow said to put it in the back of the truck. <laughs> Turn it with its mouth facing the tailgate. It's good. Well, oh, Lord, it takes up the whole truck. It does. <laughs> That's why I had him this way. Like the only way he really fits is like kind of cornered. Patty corner. Kitty cornered. Did, did you try a little gator in there? I don't have a little gator. My little gators became big gators. Uh, Except for the, the I, I have other little gator actually. Where I don't know where I put him. These were the ones I ordered. But I, yeah, I had that would be a little bit big. To, for the truck, yeah. So, um, Gatorzilla. <coughs> That's a dinosaur. Yeah. T bolt, yeah. Dinosaur. <laughs> it's dinosaur. Oh no. Oh. That well, have been perfect. Now it can't be T bolt because the uh, the green one's just as big. Yeah, right. I don't know how those are dollhouse size. <laughs> or even the skull is <laughs> must be a doll. pretty big dollhouse yeah right must be a Barbie dollhouse yeah I'm sure Barbie has gators and uh... <laughs> <laughs> big old pink dollhouse <laughs> Maryland well I think these gators will work because they're going to be in the back of the treehouse like in the swamp area right so i'm not worried about that because here's the fencing <laughs> that i'm still mad at should have been gray but so i think if we put them behind there we'll be fine yeah. stay back stay back <laughs> stay now you gotta say water. Oh yeah, water. Water. Swamp puppies. Swamp Tap puppies. it on its nose and say water. Swamp puppies. Oh, wait, wait, we need like we need a little thingy. <laughs> water. Water. <laughs> Spray paint. Yeah. Oh. I'm having moments over here. Tom. <laughs> I'm playing Robbie now. That's what we should make. We'll, we'll make action sets. <laughs> the only problem with it being Ricky and Lucy, they aren't crocodiles. Yeah, they are no alligators. <laughs> is one an alligator and one a croc? Or are they both? Because this face yeah. is different. Tip the, tip the gray one up. Let me see its snout. No, they're both crocodiles. Oh, okay, because this one is longer. It's a male. That one's a male. That one's a female. How do you tell? Slender, prettier face is on the female. Well, the green one could be a crocodile. Yeah. It yeah, could. A, yeah, the, the jaws Long in here. Nose. That's what I thought. But one was supposed to be a croc, one was supposed to be a. I'd say the green one is a croc. It's missing its eyeball. What do you mean, his eyeball? It's there. It's little. I'm looking at oh, you. Oh, okay. <coughs> Stick. No, Lisa, no. I said I was playing Robbie, but I'm not doing that. <laughs> oh, Add a pee on you. Yeah, no, no, thank you. What, what did you say, Robbie calls them now? Swamp puppies? Swamp puppies. <laughs> Them's too big for swamp puppies. Yeah, that was funny yesterday, the one in the, in the pail. 
I know he didn't want to be left behind. No, he was trying to get the, a, the little one or the little little one. The I little little one. Life. I I fell asleep. So I only see the one that was in the pail. <laughs> oh, the other one was on the patio. Uh, I mean, it was it was even teener tinier. Really? Yep. Oh. I know it is took it and put it in with the uh the uh crocodile he's got in the fish tank in his office. Yeah, he went and put it in the lake. Not in the river, but the lake. Right. Aha. Uh -huh. All right, we'll let it go. I know it comes with the job, but you know. This is a play pretend set. I'm not doing it for real. I'll pass. <laughs> All right, what do we got here? All right, so the fence has things that I'll clip together. So uh, this is what I, like I said, Shadow, I think what I want to do is put the two across and then these go like kind of like that. Am I in the picture? So they angled out and then I could put all like greenery behind it so the fence I don't have to put a whole fence right yeah so that, that the four will be enough with well the two in the front and then the two on the side will make the image of it so I think those will work but we don't want the barbed wire do we right we said all right he doesn't have barbed wire over his fence does he no no that's what I I I didn't think so couldn't fit that up. It came with it, but so, but that's what the color should have been. Okay, a Rudy TV. Welcome. Can I call you Rudy for short? I'll be like K A Rudy TV. Well, good morning. So we're hit. We're in morning now. We're in the evening. It's well, yeah, evening. Some seven o'clock here. This is a simple live, but welcome. We're just talking about a, a project that we're doing and building a mini replica of a tree house for um, Get Swamped. And so we're just kind of going over it and just having a. Hello, Puppet. Hello, Mark. <laughs> Are we crafting with Kimmy? <laughs> yes, Mark. Well, today I, I'm under. I'm just not happy with the project I want to do. It's not what I really want. So, I figured what I got all the stuff in for the treehouse. So I'm just taking it out, showing it, and then if you have thoughts or plants or that you think that something might work better, share it. So then I can get the going and everything else we need, and then. Probably in a week or two, I'm going to start putting it together. So, I know there's things that we're missing. So, I was just playing with gators right now. I was having a moment. But, so, I know we still need the grass. And either DM said he could get the moss. Or I've asked Robbie. So, wherever it gets here, we'll get the, the moss. For the tree, right? Yeah. I just need the. I put green, and I meant to spell grass. Hey, Kim. Hi, Angelo. Hello, Angelo. Hi, Angelo. So yeah, and the grass is gonna look like these little humps, and then the same type of grass fixture. Um on the bottom of the tree house. So actually for those that haven't seen it, I guess I should show you the tree house boots. So I built this. There's a video out there of the tree house that I built with Eric. All these little kitty things will come off. The ladder will stay. And the bike, the tire swing's gonna stay. And the base is gonna go out more. So it's gonna be on another board to extend the bottom out. And then the top of the tree, all the plastic's going to be off. 
So basically, the moss is going to come up here, and then the treehouse is going to turn into Robbie's office. And um, I have some things like that. I'll show you what's going to go in there. And the mailbox is going to have it's going to turn into the get swamp mailbox. I think that's it. We're going to use the owl like we planned, and some of the birds. They look like Robbie's. We're going to use those, and um. They're puffy stickers, so I'm going to just put them on some, like, sticks or something and stick them in. So that's what the treehouse is going to look like. So the grass is going to be on the bottom, and I'm also going to have some dirt and sand patches <coughs> where he parks the truck. And then these will be its little hills. <laughs> They'll blend in with the grass. So that's what the grass is for. That's the concept. So maybe that big, I should have started with that. So that just kind of shows you what, what I'll tell you where the things are going to go in the office and behind the tree house is where the crock pen is going to go. So these up here. So that will be the front and then kind of to the back to the side. Um, that's where these are going to go, right, Shadow? Yeah. In the back area with the fencing. And it's just going to be covered with trees afterwards. So I'll eat. I like how you can see through. These are so perfect. <laughs> so that's pretty so. Now I don't know when I said that I could put these in the resin for the water. The size of them. If I can find another plastic little gator. Smaller. It would work. But I don't know if this would work with the resin and put it underneath. Would that be with too much water and too high? Oh no, I think I would tuck them into the grass mounds. Like they're peeking out. Right. So basically have the water and then the grass mounds around the water? Yeah, and have them and like sitting around the water. Not in the water. Right, because of the size. And then a gator go here. Now the skeleton head, you could probably put it in the center of the water. We could do that. Welcome, Tori. Sorry, Tori. I got cool things in here, guys. So if we do this, I'm just going to do like. the tree <laughs> that's our tree house right so back here we'll have the gator right yeah back here so if i do a little pond we'll say you want the gators like on the side like where that's like a mound and a mound and then a gator in here oh you can't see so there's like a pond hey tori you know, maybe like have one of their tails in the water and Yeah, but like put a mound here and yeah. him like in here. Yeah. And then the other one on the other side, like you're saying? Yeah, and then like tuck one in behind it, like it's at the water. The on the other side of the pond though? Have them separate it? Yeah, or just here. separate them a little bit. That way your eyes don't go to just the one spot. It wants to travel to see everything. Right. So I'll put him on the other side and use yeah. the mounds around here to build it. Some of the mounds are going to go around here. And then I even have these rocks. So yeah. That could, one of the rocks could go back there. Hello, Cammy. Hi, Cammy. Hi, Hi, Tori. So, yeah. So I could put one of the rocks. <laughs> <clears throat> or I can put the rock in the water. Well, no, that's going to be too hard to cover, too. It's too big. Well, I could do the water with the resin and the blue. And then you want the, the crock head in the, in the pond. Which one would you think would look better? The rock or the res or the head? I don't know. That's why I'm asking a pity. Oh, wait, 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 wait. We have boats, too. We have the little boat. Oh, yeah, the other boat. We need the boat in the water. Yeah. I think this boat's going to be better than this one. There was a two-pack. 
Yeah. Yeah. So the boat's probably gonna go in the water. Or and maybe set the uh, skull beside the mailbox. There we go. All right. So we'll have the little boat in the water, and I can get other little rocks once they make the resin, and I have I can get smaller rocks to put. One or two for the boat, like sits up or something, or on the side. Yeah. Because those size is that size or this boat size? It don't matter. Well, now that little boat looks weird next to that big gator. Right, Peggy? <laughs> uh. Well, yeah, it's just a little too small next to that gator. So I think we have to go with that boat now. Use real rocks. Yeah, we're going to use real rocks. How about the boat at the water's edge? Yeah, well, that's what we're figuring out, Cammy. Look, so far we've made the, that, like, well, that's one big piece of pond right now. Gonna probably be bigger and put the little static grass pieces mounds, and then I'll have a couple of them. I'll build it up, and a gator hiding on one side and the other on the other. So then, do we want the boat in the water? Or do we want the boat like right behind the treehouse, sitting up like Cammy? I like the gator behind the fence instead of in the water. Well, it's going to be behind the fence, the water, and the, is that what we you mean? We have them looking out the fence like oh. Lucy and Ricky do. Yeah, and don't put them in the water, put them looking out the fence. Yeah. Yeah, the pond is going to be like in the center, and I could have one in this fence. And that way, the boat would be in the distance. So then have the boat over here, kind of? Or on the other side of the fence? I guess actually the boat would have to come on the other side of the fence. I don't know if he leaves it in there. Well, I guess just have to wait until... <coughs> well, so that makes that, like I said, then these are going to go on an angle. And then the trees are just going to be going behind there to fill up where the gators are. So I just have to figure out a pond. Which I think we're going to do the blue resin, right? I think that's yeah. the best option for water. And then dirt and sand around it and some grass mounds. Yeah. And then I have those, like, a lot of these plants that can go in there, too. They have these little round little dude things that I could stick in there. Maybe get smaller gators. I've been trying. I have the, Those were supposed to be small. But when you order on Timu, we have learned that um, it might say that it's small, but it's not. So I, I've been and I can't seem to find the small gator. I have that one gator, but the way the animals are, it just doesn't match now. Because he's more, not cartoonish, but not realistic like these are. So once you see the other animals. But then like these could go in and fill around the, the thing too. So I'll have a lot of those and then behind there. I think it would work because it's going to be in the back. It's not near the treehouse. And when I'm doing it, once I have the water out and at the base, then we'll start placing it and we'll have, we'll have a better idea of how they're going to go. Because if they're not going in the water, then I can get the thing built. And if we have to get new gators down the road, if I can find them. Then we'll just chip swap them. We won't glue them down. So it's either that boat 
And this, and as I get smaller gators, then that little boat knows. Not a frame. And then a rock back there. I think that would make the marsh, though. Right? Yeah. Right. I don't think there's anything else we would need. I just have to get so resin Ooh. and mica powder blue. So gone for the week, Tori. Are you taking a week off? Or do you mean just oh. for this week? Yeah, I think she's done for this week sending her reports in. Yeah, she's working late there, Miss Tori. So, all right, so I need to write down. So we know. So we need the resin for the water and blue mica powder. So that's going to be the water. And then I just said some, oh, and we need some rocks, but those so I can get outside. So I think that's it for the marsh then, right? Yeah. So our little boats. And then our little greens. You'll be able to tell more once you get it started put together yeah and if i have to add in stuff but i want to make sure that i have you know i have to get a board still to make the bottom and these things because i'm going to get some of the other for the front but to line up the marsh anyways we could still use these because i'm going to have to fill it in anyways where the, the back of the marsh is going to be mm -hmm. so we have all these different patterns will stick back there to make and they have these in different sizes so i think that will make the marsh area we can get away with that part using these for that um it needs to be done before his birthday cammy which is november 23rd or 22nd he always messes it up isn't Patty the 24th and he's the 23rd? I don't remember. I think. I, they, I'm thinking Robbie's the 23rd. And Lisa's saying the 22nd. Hi, Kimberly Nails. Okay, then it would be Patty's is the 23rd. Yeah. Hi, Kimberly. We're just having chit chat and uh, I can over the plants for the doll, the tree house. Mm -hmm. So, and then um, when we're done after the live, I will put up on my wish list the items that are missing that we need. We do need another Robin. <laughs> I'll go over this real quick. We're going to take one and turn him into robbie obviously and we'll change up his shirt and everything and then i'm going to use clay and i'm going to change his hat to look like z's hat that tori made so that's why we need another indiana jones this is a, i will put it back it was on my wish list um he comes with the backpack that the only thing that we don't we won't use is the backpack, but everything that came in with Indiana was a cobra, the spider, uh, the little gold artifact, uh, his whip, his sword, and a torch. And the torch was going to go on the outside of the um treehouse, so. We'll put one on each side for light. I don't think we're going to use the spiders, right, Shadow? Are we? Not unless they tuck it into the back to hide it for like nature. Right. Because it's just giant. 
Yeah. He just needs a little too big. But the cobras. Yes. The cobra, yeah, we can use the cobra. Yeah, the snakes that, that um, we'll talk about that in a minute. So basically out of that kit for $10, we are using almost everything. It's just the backpack. Um, you know, Rob, we can give Robbie the backpack if he ever feels like, you know, he needs to go for a hike. Just kidding. <laughs> but, so, we'll need one more kit. Baby gators in that he's been catching. Yeah. So. But. He'll have a ponytail and everything. I'm donating the hair for that. Um, you gave in? <laughs> I'm giving in. I'm donating some hair to make Z's ponytail. All right, stand up, Robbie. So yeah, like these, I think will look cool on the side of the tree, uh, right outside the, the you know, uh, walls of the the office area. And then I'm changing the table up to this chair, and then there's a table somewhere over here for the office. I don't know where it went. Oh no, where's my tree? I'm sure we'll find it along our adventure. If not, it might be in the bag still. So, all right. So we got the swamp area. I don't think anything but the resin is what's needed. So that's easy. We're not using you. And we have that. So, and then we have Robbie and his little accessories. Oh, Cammie, you came in late, and Tori, and Kimberly, here's the, the gator skull. They're going to try and get me to rhinestone it out with the amethyst. I think I have amethyst. I know I have quite a few different, but I will check. So, and then we'll figure out where that goes. Our owl is too big, but he'll be our mascot, and he'll be our friend through this adventure. So we can name them. Can you guys think of a name, please? He'll, he'll just chat if anybody can think of a name for the owl. He'll he'll be the one that looks over. He'll be uh, the supervisor for building. We'll put them to use, right? Yep. Um, I just got some of these. Just I don't know. They might be good to bury or something. I don't know. Put the dirt Walk around. We'll that. figure something out for him where the turtles are or something. So those I just picked up. That's our gate. I can put a turtle in the pond. Oh yeah. Um, I have that, I don't know, with the owl on top of the tree. That That's one big owl. This is going to turn out to be amazing. I'm I'm hoping it will. What is, what is that? Just it's just a, like rocks. Oh, okay, that's what I was gonna get. Half. Looks like there's a little moss or something growing yeah. on. Yeah. Yep. So I just pulled that out. Well, you never know. Yeah. Might, might be needed somewhere. It lays down. Yeah, it lays up flat. But I might be able to break it too if I need to. Um, depending what I do with the, the turtle area. So. That tree would have to be pretty darn big, Tammy, to put the owl in. Oh, yeah. Oh, you didn't see the, the tree house that I built when I did the other one? The walkway. Yeah, I could be used as the walkway. So I pulled it. This is the tree house, Cammy. I built one with on. Um, alive for Eric and mm. I'm just using the shelf and the ladder, the swing and the mailbox, everything else. Um, and the table and chairs that came with it, we're going to use them for displays. So, yeah. Okay, Tori. Oh, so yeah, you see it. So yeah, that's, it's going to be the same tree house. But the base is going to be wider to fit everything on it. So. 
but we have a sticker that's an owl. That's what we originally planned because it does look realistic. And I'll make sure when I paint it and all that and it sticks in the tree, he does look more like. So that's the owl. But he's going to just be our buddy and chill. So. And then the moss that's going to go up in the trees, I'm going to mix it up with these leaves. So the moss will hang up and then use this as a filler in little groups to, so and then I have another little one that's coming for the fence so I think these will look mixed in fine with the peat moss because they they have a realistic look to it right yep so I'm happy with those and they'll they'll fit in the tree too like the other way they were made with the plastic It'll slide right in. So that's going to fill the top of the tree. Harold the Hooter. <laughs> if the owl is too big for the tree, put the tree on the owl. Putt, putt. I was going to guess that Mark said that <laughs> without looking at the chat. Yeah. Putt, putt said it. So, <laughs> um, so yeah, so I grabbed that. That's going to be the tree part topping part mixed with the moss. I still need to get some more trees, obviously, to go in the front of the farm, because this bag's gonna be the swamp. So we keep that over here. Oh. And that's Robbie, that's our grass. Okay, so then we have our truck. Now, we thought the, the gator, we still didn't figure out where that's gonna go, but we can down the road. Um, he doesn't really fit in this truck, Shadow, too well. I mean, Kitty Corden, he does. So we can do that if we want it. Or we could put it at the base of the tree by the mailbox, like Shadow said. Big blue. Yep. As long as it don't take off. <laughs> I had to get that in once because the truck will be glued down. Chestnut. I think I would bling it out and put it right there where the hedgehog is sitting on your picture. Where the hedgehog? Yep, on the ground. Here. Is that what you're talking about? The picture on the box. Yeah. Yeah, I'd sit it right there. And then have the mailbox right behind it. Yeah, well, it's going to come out a little. Remember that because I am going to yeah. take the, the base and kind of make like this. I don't want it perfectly straight. but So this way we'll get the parking area over here. You know, yeah. And then the animals. Then we'll have what the, the turtles and the pigs over here maybe. And then behind is the gators. And then this will be the mailbox and stuff. Because we're, we'll, or the mailbox could be here and behind here will be the cars. So. And then I also going to have plexiglass that's going to go over it. Once we build it and I get the dimensions, my aunt has a glass shop. And I have a huge piece of plexiglass, but she always has it. So once I tell her the dimensions, she'll cut me the four pieces, five pieces I'll need. Four sides in the top, and then I'll have to glue them to make the case. And um, that way I'll have a dust cover over it. So that's going to be cool. Um, so, so actually we could put the truck back here then. All right, I can draw my skills, people. Just don't make fun of me because I'm just drawing, yeah, quick here. <laughs> so the truck in the back, like, this is the gator marsh we set off to the back. Here. So put the trucks and Robbie and Z here. Type. And then put where the hedgehog is, put the gator skull. Yeah. In the mailbox here? Yeah. 
sorry. Mailbox in the gator skull. And then we have the tire swing. I can't forget that's going on. And the ladder. So yeah, because the ladder will work right here. Where they are. So that will work. Like they're walking in with the mailbox. Gator skull. And then here's his office. Is up in there. So um now over here. Major Sun Yeon. That's a desk. What's a desk? Right now we're planning out a treehouse gift for Get Swamped. Um, and just working on figuring out what else we need and where things are going to go and see what else we need to put on the wish list. Everyone that has been con sending in contributions and items for it is going to be part of it as a gift. Um, so that's what we're just seeing. If What else if we have enough of everything? So um, his little table. I have that, that little table I showed you guys. So I, up here there'll be the little tree table. But then off to the side like that. So we're going to do the office real quick and then we'll go through that. We have a little mask. And I think you were saying to have it out the window, Shadow. We no, look in, have it looking straight out at you. So from this back window, back part? From the very opening. Go straight in with it. Yeah, where the blue sign is. Oh, I'm too high. I can't see you with your bar. <laughs> so you behind the frog, where those pictures are. Yeah, where the picture's at. I put the mask right there. Okay. So yeah, so that this this table that came in here is going to be against the wall. And these two things are going to be on the sides. So this way, then the little chair and table will be his little desk-like area. Yeah. Piece. And then that way, the, so you want that leg like back there. So that'll be on the wall right above that table. Yeah. Yeah. That, so that's why, so then I have these artifacts. So the mask will go on the wall. This might be too big, that one, but these we could stand up, I'm thinking. I could take the loop off her head. With the stones all around it. Oh, we have him. Oh. Depending how big I have room. Or I could just do this with the crystals. With un sitting under the back of the table. So I could tuck it. So you don't, you, it did, probably won't be too big. But I just thought he, with the artifacts mixed in with the crystals. Yeah. Um, they'll pick up on some of that. We had the other little, the other artifact thing. And then here's some of the crystals I picked out. I have more. And I have all different types that are stones and they're real chips. So we're just going to do his office like he has with the crystals all over it. So. I have them up here. But there's tiger's eye right here. There's a piece of amethyst. There's rose quartz. I try to pick up some like odd shaped ones to replicate it. But are, yeah, curvy, and flat. Yeah. So, I have some fluorite. I have citrine. So, it'll be displayed like that. I'll see if I can find a mini, mini spare. I think I have one that will probably work and put it on a little stand up there. So, basically, the office is just going to be 
the little table and chair with the artifacts and uh, the rocks, right? Yeah. That would work. And then the animals will be on the outside and all that. So if anybody has any thoughts that of any other artifacts, I think the stones, I think these could go in each corner then. Put the stones in front of them. Right? Yeah. Sounds good. And the mask is going to go up on the wall. So I guess it's going to be like that with the table. And then that could kind of go in front of the table or laying down. And I can go on the little corner. And then I'm just going to fill it all with stones. We're going to crowd the um, the office. <laughs> yeah, because Robbie's not going up in the office on this. So I, that actually will work, I think, because then we'll have the whole space to the office, right? Yep. So I think that will work. I was thinking this would have been smaller, but size proportion again. <laughs> so I like Shadow's idea. The Gator Skull will go out by the mailbox. The only little other thing in here is but it's not enough <laughs> is the fruit <laughs> fruits and veggies now do we want to fill the truck or with all the fruit <coughs> in a little basket <coughs> and get one more set of little veggies and put two little baskets of fruit or do you want the whole truck filled with fruit whatever you think Oh no. Be decided later. Yes and no. Because I have to get the stuff. So put it a little but I can get a little crate that I can do. And I so I just need to know how much more fruit I'll have to get. That's the only problem. They come in a ten pack. I don't remember how much those were. But they take two weeks to come in, so we'll have to figure that out sooner than later. And if I want a little basket or the two little baskets or two little boxes with the fruit, or we could just fill the whole truck with the fruit. Put it in a little box or basket. If you should I put, get some clay and make some fruit for you. Yeah, I was going to do that, but I was like, I don't know if I'll have time. And then I got to order all the clay. And I think those were 89 cents. I would just order white and paint it. Mm -hmm. So. Oh. They are cute. I don't even know what is in there. You got a carrot, a radish, strawberry, looks like an apple, tomato, a pepper, a kiwi. I don't know what that yellow thing is. A turnip. That's another pepper and a what is that thing? The little brown. Looks like a I don't know what it looks like. That turnip. I think it would have a great potato. Like a potato. Uh, yeah, a sweet potato. I think I like the radish. He's cute. Probably because it's pink. <laughs> Make the, the veggies make me think of the turtles. The crate would help fill the bed. Yeah, I was thinking that the turtles need food too. So I guess we're going to need some more uh, veggies. 
I just didn't know how many I could move here. Um, all right, so, so I think we have his office covered, right? His office is done. Yeah. We have our artifacts, and I have tons of the crystals, so I'm not worried about that. And the office also gets, where did it go? The lights, the lanterns, the mask, and that chair. I'm keeping it separate. That's the marsh. And this is Robbie. All right, move you over here. So we need more fruit and veggies and a basket. We need to put a dent on the, everyone wants this dent on the back of this truck. No. I did have this that I was going to do something with it, but then it's too tall for the to, for the truck. <laughs> this is like the gator meat bucket. Well, not that. We you know how he hauls down the buckets with the meat. <laughs> but I don't know. If I, I threw it in here, I can cover it, paint it, change it if we need a bucket for something. But that's that. I don't think anything else in the office. So the office is done up top, and then the birds and all that are going on the sides and the fencing. <clears throat> so, and his rocks. I'll put Robbie's whips in here so we don't lose it. Snake over there. I can just see it flying. So, we'll work on the, the, the fruits and the veggies. And a few baskets or something. I'll see what I can think of for that. Um, so then the truck and Robbie and Z, I need to paint. And then I have to make, get swamp signs for his shirt. And then... Are we changing the color of the pants? Are we keeping that? I thought you said you were going to keep the pants as they are. That's what I thought. Yeah. I remember. And the boots. So, and what color are we painting this shirt? Yeah. Well, okay. that has to be black. Black, and then I got to get little green writing. Yarn. Oh, yam. <laughs> I thought I said yarn. He always wears shorts. Hey, look, I'm not making shorts on him. He wears pants when it's cold. <laughs> he always wears shorts. Oh, black shirt. Yeah, so black shirt. And um, I'll have to figure out how to get, get swamped. I don't know if the cricket's going to type it that small to be able to fit on there. Or I'm going to have to write it. So... And then his hat is fine for Robbie. You should be able to do it with your cricket. That tiny it will make it that tiny for his shirt writing? It like, should. Whatever size font you could set it for. Yeah, but I'm saying where are we putting it on his shirt? Because if you're saying it's going up in the corner, I don't know if I can get all those on the back. back. Oh, if I could do it on the back, then I should have no problem. I thought that's what I'm asking. Yeah, I thought we you were could being... put the gator call message that he has. Whatever it is he has on the back of his t shirt for when he goes on gator calls. Oh, yeah. I forget what it says gator something trapper. No sense. Nuisance gator trapper. Just put this one up. Too much to put on that yeah, he's got a tiny back. <laughs> and then and just put get swamped. Yeah. yeah. So I'm gonna fill that hole with clay, and then I'll put get swamped. All right. <laughs> Not very cold much in Florida. S A on front and get swamped on back. 
S A. What's S A? Um, I can't remember what it stood for. I can't either. So, all right. So, Robbie, continuing. He's gonna have a black shirt and get swamped on the back. What about his face? Fight loss and alligator trapper. It's L A D. Oh. I got gotcha, you. I got gotcha. you. Now, those other t shirts that he wears, that's another sponsor. Yeah. S A. Oh, yes. That's right. All right. So wow. then Robbie's done. Now, when I get Z, is he having a black shirt too? Oh, yeah. He wears different colors sometimes, but. Mm -hmm. I know when he goes out in the gator call, it is, but do we want it so they're not like, his hat is going to be the red and black with the little goggles. I guess black's all right. So we'll do his shirt the same. Yeah, may as well. So, and the same thing on the back of his the shirt to so get swamped, right? Yeah. Yeah, because if I do red or something, we put get swamped, that's going to look crispy. <coughs> right? Yeah. Yeah. We need his hat. It's red and black. And we need the glasses. So, when I said here is going to go the rocks and the artifacts and the table. And then, like we said, here is going to have the moss. And the birds are going to go up here. And a butterfly. That's those are going up in the tree. And then in the tree trunk will go the owl. And the squirrel. Since we're doing nature and his thing. So we got the squirrel and we have an owl that goes in there. When Patty gets here, you're going to have to add a ball and a chain to Zoltan's leg. Ha, 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 ha. I don't think so. And then, so, now we still have another rock that can go somewhere. Half a rock. And now, here's the cool things. Let's see. Oh. I have a little park bench. I don't know. I just thought it was for seating underneath the tree or something. Right? Yeah. So, we'll do that somewhere. And I got the glue. <laughs> I finally found the tube that I like. It has the little needle. So, it will be nice and neat. <laughs> and this stuff is strong. If Just I can get it. the cap off of it. Yeah. Ha ha. Well, this one's a squeeze one. This one's not a tilt the bottle over and pour it on Kimmy. <laughs> but. No. That's some strong glue. So. That will be awesome. 
Um, these are the animals that Tori sent in, and these are the ones that we're going to be using. So, some he has, some he wants, some are nature, right, Shadow? Yeah. This skunk is weird to me. His stripes are wrong, aren't they? It can't be a skunk. What is it? Not a skunk. Look it up. I get, well, I'm using the phone. I can't do a Google search yet. No. An ocelot? A badger? Yeah, it could be a badger. That's a little <coughs> I think it's cool. I meant the first one, not the... Oh, this one? Chad, what was this one? Badger, I think. The... It's a cool one. That's an ocelot or a serv or a serval. Okay, so Cam, you hear me? He was right. She said ocelot. So this is a badger. So we're putting him in there, right? We said. Yeah. Uh, we have this one. It's a cat. He's <laughs> kind of cute. His little face. Too Is that a raccoon? I don't know. That's what I'm trying to figure out what they are. They don't look like a raccoon. No, I got raccoons and that ain't no raccoon. Yeah, that ain't no. Here's his tail. Wrapped around. <laughs> yeah, raccoons don't have faces like that. To me, he kind of looks like a monkey face, but... Sugar glider, maybe? Sugar glider. Hmm. Let's put him over here. Uh, he just got that funny tail. I don't know. Put it, whatever you put in there that we don't know what's called, Robbie will have a name for it. Yeah. yeah. You're right. You're right. Sorry, right, let's see what a sugar glider looks like. Sugar glider. No, I don't think that it is. And now I know what a sugar glider is when I've seen them. They're cute. Ooh, look at this one. Someone's pet. Well, wait a minute. No. Here's a picture of it. I'll see if I can get you the face. The other one. The color's off, because I don't know. Here's his... Don't be camera shy. No, it doesn't look like that at all. Mm -mm. Uh -oh. is, so... Nope, he's not a sugar glider. On my other phone, I could do a Google search. The black and white one is a spotted skunk, according to Google. Hi, Patty! Hi, Goofy, Patty. not realistic. Hi, Patty. Uh, koala. What did we say this was? An ant eater? No, that, that, yeah, the next one. Ant eater. Ant eater. I think. It's ugly. 
<laughs> he is. You wanted him in there. Yeah, we just took him in and there, aren't we? So there's that. I'm showing you these before I show you the cuties. <laughs> and then this dude. You say this is a kangaroo or something? I don't know which way to hold him. He scares me when I look at him through the computer, his eyes. It's a tap, tapper, how do you say that? Pinko to you. Crump, Kinko to you. It's awful big for Kinko to you. I was gonna say, that's no Kinko to could be. Could it? Mark, are you doing Google searches? Well, like Peggy said, Robbie will know. Yeah. The animals, they're going in. Oh, where did the black bear go? Well, then we have this thing. Wait a minute. I'm missing the lemur and the Oh, here he is. Okay. I got nervous. Oh wait a minute. Are these the ones we said we weren't putting in or we are? I'm so confused now. The ones that we was going to put in you had in a bag, I think. Yeah, these were these were the ones that were here. We don't have to put in. So these are the animals we have. That I did that backwards. So if we don't like any of these, we don't have to use these. This just makes me think of the lemur tail. I'm like he stole it. <laughs> Big bushy eyebrows. It's a crossbreed. Yeah, that one might be an ard ardwa. Actually, I'm weeding vinyl. The one Shadow said was an ant eater. Is a I don't know how to say that word, so it's not an ant eater. All right, so these were the mysterious animals. That's right. I did it backwards. If we want to use these or not. These are the ones we pulled out and said yes to the lemur, obviously. Was that the sloth? I forget what he is. Gotta help me, Shadow. Yeah, that's a sloth. Three toes sloth. Mm -hmm. The black bear. I can't believe they made it space green. What? That's slaw. Oh. <laughs> and then. That one's going in. And a monkey. It's going in. Yep, the sloth. <laughs> so, those are going in with the gator. Oh, here's the table. There's the little table that's going to go in there. The thing. We have a beehive to go somewhere. And then, what came in? Oh, I was just going to stick this somewhere for water. Oh. Um, and then I have a deer, because we said natural, so a deer. Sloth has a type of a moss going in hid fur. So they have in the wild sometimes a green. Sloth is, the sloth is so slow, algae grew on it. 
<laughs> yeah, so then there's a little deer. Oh, he's backwards. I'm like, wait a minute. There he is. So I'm going to put the deer in there too. So these you guys think about, we kind of, we put these aside that we said no. But anyone that has donated that would want one of these in there. You sent something or Tori, you sent them and you want more in there. Let me know. Um, so like I said, anyone that is, you know, planning and sending donations has an opinion. Now, these are what I ordered because my turtle was too big and this is what came in. Oh, no, we got a sneak, obviously. And I got to get rabbits. I was supposed to get three little piggies. Well, they sent me two piggies. <laughs> so. There's a little. Oh, well, at least they're a better size. Mm hmm. This is the size I want it. The mama and baby. Mm hmm. Um, I need to paint them black, though. With white spots. Or put some black pokey dots on them. Mm hmm Yep. And we have squiggly and wiggly. Yep. And and instead of giving me a third piggy, they gave me a fence. <laughs> I have another. Huh? One of them could be Skittles, though. Yeah. Yep, so. We got the little piggies. And then the turtle came where I should have had two turtles, but I guess they had different size is this thing. And I'm not sure what it is. Like there's a little scoop on it. Is it where the turtle, something that goes in with, with turtles? Thank you, Patty. Give Elle's a huge hug from me. Tell her I said hi and love her. Love you too. Aww. Patty, I emailed you. So that came with the turtle. I'm not. I don't know what it is. Gonna cook the turtle? <laughs> that, that, that I don't know. Yeah, I know it has a spoon and it has that and I don't know. Turtle stew. And then it came with a little. Is that a stove? I don't know. I'll go watch my mail later. I emailed it already. And there's the turtle. He's cute, isn't he? So I don't know. Yeah, wood burning stove. At first I thought... It was just like a, a thing, a decoration you put in there, like a fountain or something. But I didn't order that. I ordered three turtles and three piggies, and apparently they came in sets like this. <laughs> I'm missing the birds. Or you mean we're missing the birds? We have birds. Yeah, so... Do we need another turtle or we think one turtle's good? Or we could put this in the middle and I can get another turtle to put around it with the vegetables. Whatever you decide, Kimberly, you might find out that you're not going to have enough room for all of those animals and stuff. Yeah. Once well, you get it built. Mm, well, once I put the board on the bottom and extended areas, these I think when we took them out, but these because sizes are going to be okay. Make it too big. No, it's not going to be too big, but the board has to be extended because it's only that round little base. 
So I'm just bringing it out a little bit so I can put the gators and stuff and make a pond because there's nowhere on that platform that I'll be able to put a pond. Yeah, so you're probably going to find out that you're not going to have enough room for all. Yeah. <coughs> well, these are going up in the tree. The birds are stickers. These are going to go up. They're getting tucked in. And then I have a bunny. Being this size, these are these are okay. And the turtle in that section. And the truck. So basically the truck's gonna go back here to the side with Robbie and Z. And the tree's gonna be right here. And then in the front she said this the, next to the mailbox is going to be the skull. And then over here is going to be the little piggies. I know it's going to be kind of not where the piggies well, We could put the piggies that way. We could put the little turtles. And then is there a little brown shack? On Robbie's run? You mean a shack? Now a 3D printer would be handy. Is that right? Uh, so the tree's still right here. So it's going to be smaller than the table. And then behind him was the gators with this pond. Like that. You're not going to stand up, but you know what I'm talking about with the fence. So there's that, and the pond's going to be in the middle. With the rock in the pond, and the boat could be off to the side back here. That's not going to exist. So that's as big as it's going to be. From this edge of the table, the tree's here. So he's going to come here. So if I stop it here, it's going to be about that. But it's not going to be completely straight because I'm going to have the board where it curves. So we'll shorten it a little. This is going to be the part that's more, as the gators is the biggest spot. Does that make sense? Yeah. And then the rabbits. This fence will probably won't use this fence. I have other fences, but I don't think that I like that. So, but we'll have to put more little food here. A little bit of. If, the, if that's, yeah, you know, like he does, even like three little pieces or something for the turtle, like he does on the ground. What do we do for the piggies? Just put them there like that? And then a couple rabbits? Mm hmm. They're going to go over here. Oh, the brown shacks, the outhouse. And then, so I might not have to extend it. It might be just this part that I'm extending. But weren't you putting the pond behind the alligators? Yeah, that's why I put the rock. In. <laughs> oh, you didn't see the rock. <sighs> yeah, the alligators are going to be behind the fence and then the pond's going to be like right here. It's not going to be a huge pond. And then I'll put the little rock out there or something and then the boat to the side on the other side of the fence.
that's part is going to be the biggest part of this, you know. Yeah, the pigs are in the spot with the gators, but I think they'll get lost. That's why. So that's why I'm thinking. I, I know what they're saying, Peggy, Patty, with the piggies and her. When you, you know where he has them and you see them but I think just to have them in the area I mean if you don't agree shadow <clears throat> you speak up like this is everyone's input so I'm just saying the gators are there they're behind the peak it'll be up the swamp pond and then all trees back that way it's not the boat. Exactly rock no I think because they're, they're going to get the sizing yeah. So I think if I put the turtle, the pigs, and the buddies together in one area, mm -hmm. we'll take up that corner, right? And then Robbie, that's the mailbox. And then these are just going to be, there's going to be more back here. So, you know, deer. Then you have all the, the tree with the birds in it and the, the siding. So then all these other animals are going to hide in there. The lemur can be up on the branch up top. This could be tucked up next to the tree trunk. Does that make sense? The cobra, I don't know what to do with the cobra. Where he's going. Yeah, we talked about painting the gates gray, or the fence gray. Yes. That's the color it was supposed to come in. Oh, I see. It. Yeah, they weren't supposed to be black. <gasps> I was a little sad when that happened because they had barbed wire, so they should have been this color. So yeah, they're definitely gonna get changed the color. Um, drop something. And I gotta do the little hooks. They're black too. But <coughs> so and then so the fences are yeah, are gonna be sprayed gray. The office is fixed. I think what what is here, besides what I'm missing, that I need to complete it, is, is a Z. So another Indiana Jones. And then I need the static grass. For the, for the ground, I have the dirt and gravel. I think that's it. And then the resin, the little, but those are, I want the, the one-time use resins for the water with mica glue powder. I think that's all we're missing then, right? Fence gray or silver. Yeah, it's going to be gray. And I'm not going to make it too shiny. It wasn't. I'm going to try and do it the same color that this is. So I think that's the perfect. It's not shiny. And it's what it was supposed to be. And I don't know why it came that way. There wasn't an option. So, But that's what happens. Hi, Dan. Hello, Dan. Hi, Dan. So, I think then we'll ha we have everything, right? Because I'm going to use watercolors like for the tree and the trunk. That I like that look. I just need the moss from Robbie. Or Dan, are you able to get the moss and get it mailed to me?
The dirt is outside, the gravel is outside, and my rocks are outside. I have plenty of that. So, I'll pick up the resin. And then, um, so on my wish list, I'm going to put the Indiana Jones. He was $10 for the little kit. I'll stick him on Amazon. And the grass comes in a little jar. It's just like this. But it, this is, um, it will look just like this, but it's like all loose green stuff. And then you put it down and um, it clings together with glue and stuff. So that's how we're going to build up the ground. So I think that's the only two things we're missing. Oh, and we have a fence too. For his property. And it goes, it's folded in half. So it's double the size. So we do have that. It's cute. So we'll fence off his property when we're done. And that should fit about the size of what it's going to be to go around. It's going to connect to the to the fencing of the gators, and then the rest is going to be trees. So. Oh, thank you, Cammie. So we have Z. <laughs> yep. Then I will get. I will get it. I will get the um, the other Indiana Jones with that. And then, like we said, there's the static grass. And um, the resin at the dollar store. I have one. I haven't used. I don't know if we'll need one or two, but I know those are a dollar twenty-five. And that should be enough. I might use the one that I have just to see how big it spreads out. And then I always get more. So then, and we'll make that blue. And I have to look for the grass and see what the grass is. So I think that's about it. So. I have little bricks from left over too, if we need to put them anywhere for stepping stones. If the other things are little, both tiny, tiny little gray bricks. Um. Peggy, are you able to make more fruit or do you want me to just get another pack? Um. I want to just get another pack because I don't know when I would get around to it. Okay, that's it. So, and we need to get some more fruit and veggies. That's fine. And a basket. So, <coughs> I'll play around. I'll see with it, Cam. Maybe I'll get the fruit, veggies, basket, and the grass. And leave the Indiana Jones on there. So if anyone would rather order through the wish list, that will be there. But we don't need. We only need a few more things, guys. And um, I have everyone's name that has donated. And um, I'm gonna do that on the the cricket and all the little uh, everyone's names. I'll tape them out using the cricket. I do have the green. I'm pretty sure I have the green paper for the cricket. I think I forgot. I think I did pick it up. I have to go check. Because I know I, I had a green and it wasn't the right green. And then I think I found the, the dark green. So. I don't think I don't, anything else we're missing. Anybody think we got it all? Rabbits. Funny. 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 Before I forget. Funny. Those I can order and where I got these, so they'll be the same. So I'm mad that they only sent me two piggies in a fence. <laughs> and it was supposed to just be the turtles. Three. Huh? 
Especially since it, if it was supposed to be three. Yeah, it said three little piggies. There was no fence in, in, in there. And then, and the turtle was a two pack of a turtle and then this thing. And not this. They had a turtle on each side of that. But. Well, I would just let them know. Yeah. Maybe they'll send you another one. I just don't know what this is. She knows. She's, when I see a spoon, are we going to eat the sip turtle? I thought it could be like his water bowl, but it has a spoon and a... I don't know what it is. Probably not going to eat that. I don't know you guys what you think. Do you need a few ferns in the swamp by the gators? Do you need any? I have a whole bag of different ferns for the gator marsh. And I have some more realistic things. Oh, okay, Patty. Peggy, Patty, the bad. There we go. I haven't done that in a while. Okay, mouse. Which one do you like? I put one in there for you and one for her. Is that an inner tube with an oar? We're we talking about this thingy that I showed. I don't think that's an inner tube. It looks like a spoon, right, Shadow? It looks like a spoon. A spoon on top of a napkin. On top of a bowl. Yeah. Yeah, it is. It looks like a spoon with something. A cook set. Bowl. Yeah, it looks like there's a blue thing in the bottom, and then, I don't know, it's just like, like crackers or something, like a, like some kind of, I don't know, rice cake thingy, I don't know. Maybe it came with the turtles? Yeah. Well, maybe they are thinking it's for turtle soup. No, that's me. When I first saw it, it was upside down, so I didn't recognize it until I took it out. And this, I don't know if this is supposed to be a fountain or a stove. I'm trying to think what I could use this, how I could change it. Looks it looks like a little wood burning, or like a little stove, a little wood burning stove. That's what it looks like, but then I thought because it came with the turtle, was it just like one of those little decorations? Looks like one of those lanterns. Yeah. Around. Like a Japanese lantern. Yeah. So, should we use that, leave that out? I don't know. All I need to think is if we we're where the piggy's going with one turtle, if we don't have that, <coughs> bunnies, this area is going to be a little fenced in. <laughs> oh no, Robbie's laying down. He's fixing the truck. And his hands in his like, help. That's some oriental decoration. Well, do we leave it in there to give the turtle something with some fruit? Some fruits and veggies? I need a little help here with that section. All right. I'll give the turtle some veggies. I'm give them some veggies. So I'm going to get two more packs of veggies. Pigs together and give them both veggies. Yeah, it's a 10 piece. So I'm going to get two more packs of veggies. Because then that will give us enough to put over here. And put two packs in like a basket 
and one pack in each basket or something in the truck. And they'll fill them in. Um, we won't use this thingy. And I guess we could use that just like a decoration kind of in that area. I don't know. We'll play with that one. Maybe I could add clay to it and turn it into a, a little watering fountain. I don't know. But Piggy's the turtle. I think it's going to be cool. So we're not going to use that. Were we using the sloth? I don't remember. I mixed them up. Using the what? The sloth. Was he a, a yes? I don't know. I, I don't know. Do. Huh? I thought we were going to, but... That, I couldn't remember. I Well, I think so, because he's still on the table. And those were the ones we were not using. All right. He was just kind of laying there, so. Because uh, so Robbie was... wants to get one. Okay. Yeah, yeah. he's wanting one. Mm -hmm. so, those are just if I need them. Those. There's a little watering can. That's that. It's a bench. We have the honeybee. That's why I turned the table and chair. So this is just Robbie's desk. Can't take it. And then the other tables are for his artifacts. Oh. So then those are his artifacts and his crystals. Oh, I know what I can do. I don't use them. We can use the barrel here. So everything that we're going to use, I'm going to put into this little tray for when we get started in a week or two. We will uh, be organized. There we go. They fit in there. Dan, here's the mask. I guess we could leave it black. I was trying to think if I wanted to add anything else. Oh. Or add a little gold to him. I could. Like on his eyes. Like lines. I think Scooter was Robbie was I thought Scooter was Robbie Sloth. You're fine, Lisa. So that can go in there. The little fish. We're not gonna lose anything. Oh his torch goes in the rock. Cobra goes in. Alright, so say bye to the little piggies. Now, when I ask you guys, you know where they are. They're in the rock. So, all right. So, we're going to do that. Oh, see? Almost lost it. Oh, yeah. We have his. So, they will just have their little, you know, machete. Machete. Look at that in there. This thing we're not sure on. I have. This is a wood metal. We only have one fence. So, I'm not going to. I'm going to say no to this fence. Because in the treehouse, plus the extras from Eric, we also have those other wooden fences. So, those go like, And then we have this fence. I don't know what to do with the other boat. We, but we said we need the bigger boat. That's our greener way. Owls, you've been doing very good. I'm very proud of you supervising. He's done well. Right, guys? Yeah. They didn't talk back. The animal's well behaved. <coughs> Gotta say. Oh. I think I need a little baggie. That's the greenery for the top of the tree. <coughs> Put the gators in here. Supposed to get up in the hundreds all this next week. Oh, really? 106 on Wednesday, I think. Oh, wow. Did Peg Patty hear me? Patty, let me know another number if there's one you like.
Um, so there's our gators. Today, I don't know if you heard when I first said it, or saw shadow. It this morning it downpoured here and it was flooding and it was it was going for four thirty in the morning to almost eight o'clock hard. And I had to run out and I was slipping and sliding and it was flooding everywhere. It was crazy. Yeah. Two you got it. Two and eight. Let me write that down. All right, and I'll you have a giveaway too, Patty. So I will stick those two in there for you and send them to the farm. Okay, hon. All right, so that oh now I can put the little clips in there. Not use them. And we're not using the barbed wire. We're not using the backpack. We're gonna make sure there's nothing else in the backpack. Now we cleaned it out. Okay. Yeah, there's nothing we need to put these anywhere. I can't think. Okay, that's that. Oh, we need the clay. <coughs> I have that. And then a little bag. I don't want to lose the fruits, guys. So... I'm going to get, I probably could go right on and get everything but a Z with what Cammie sent. And I have a couple of dollars in there and get all that taken care of. And then I think the last thing will be is the Indiana Jones. Um, at, right now for what the cost, um, I'm pretty sure I could find a board. Or I might use plexiglass and have my aunt just make the board, the plexiglass board for me to extend it out. Um, I'll work on that. And then, and I don't think there'll be really any cost to that. And the case. And Dan didn't answer me. So I'll probably have to keep talking to Robbie and let Dan get to Well, him. he did answer you. He just said that he can't hear you. I'm on the phone with my sister. Oh. Okay, thank you. Well, I will talk with Dan. If Dan is not, Robbie said to email him. I did tell him not to question me. <laughs> so. Um, we will get that. So I'm thinking <laughs> two weeks, three weeks, that will bring us in the middle of September. I'll have, then I'll have like the two, three weeks September. If we have to tweak something or come up with whatever, we'll, we have October and then get it out of here in November. So... And then I'm going to have to figure out how we're shipping it and the shipping cost and all that. And uh, I'm praying that it, it's not, I don't see it going to be heavy. It's not going to be that heavy. I mean, the car has a little weight to it. Well, size is going to add a lot to the postage too. Huh? The size is going to add to the right. postage too. So... <laughs> that's what I'm yeah my main thing is the size which is not going to be it's not going to be that huge it's not that tall but it's going to be a... but I'm thinking it and thinking I sent shadow a box and uh, the size box that I had sent her and that was heavy is the size that this is going to be it's not a little taller so I don't think it's going to be that bad. But we'll play around with it. I'll keep you guys posted on what we got going. If there's anybody out there that's a crafter that wants to make card, if they want to participate or you want me to make it, I like to just include people. So if there's somebody in there that wants to make a card and get it to me, um, I'll send you the names of the people that have donated and you can do that. I just want anybody that wants to pitch in and do something 
you know, put that out there. But that is what we have, guys. I think we did pretty good. Mm -hmm. I'm impressed we got it. That, that's a, came very quick, came very together. I thank all of you for, you know, making this come true. Um, I know Shadow doesn't like that. Shadow did come up with it and said, when I was building dollhouses, how cool it is to make a mini farm. And we all thought it would be awesome. So I thought include everybody and get that to come true. Shadow has given quite a good vision to it. And uh, you guys' input is awesome. And then I just went out and tried to make it come together as real as possible. Yeah, thank you guys. This is one thing we can guarantee you don't have. And that's for sure. No, he didn't have a singing gator on pulling a sleigh with a picture of him. And now he'll have a miniature treehouse. <laughs> so, and you know what? The owls will still go to Robbie. We'll just tell him that he he built the treehouse. <laughs> he's cute, guys, but he's gonna he's gonna be our mascot through this. <coughs> That's what we're gonna do. Not bad. Everything that has been ordered. This is only a little bit of stuff that we're not gonna use out of it that came in kits. That's not bad. Oh, I'm sorry, the little boat and the spider. Um, and then the tree house. Most of it we're going to use out of this tree house, but there's the bee, the sticker. We also have some other things to go on the ground and ladybugs. They'll have his pizza. So that'll be in there. And I think you agree too, right, um, Peggy and Chev? We like the watercolors on the paint, on the tree. Right. I did too. Um, I'm just gonna blend it differently than I did Eric's. Obviously, make it a little more realistic and a little more yellow. And but um, when I do the tree bark, but I think yeah, the watercolors and I like how I did. Well, the base is still gonna be painted green, but it's gonna have more realistic <laughs> grass. So. Yep. Yeah. We could make Z ride the bike. Just kidding. Telescope. I don't think that that. But yeah, so the birds, if anyone's questioning, I'll show you. I think it was, it was Patty was saying, where's the birds? So, real quick. I thank you guys because I just was having the heat got to me. And like I said, my project, I just wasn't. I want to get the other ones and show you. So, and all this stuff came in today. At, well, through the week and the last part of the order was here today, actually. So, um, I said this is perfect. These are the animals. These are erasers. So, I'm just going to give these to Eric because he wanted a set for school. And he always gets little animal erasers. So, I'm just going to give those to Eric. He can use them. This is the, the top of the tree we're not using. This is the tree kit. So that's basically what was out of that box that we wanted. And I'm going to use the watercolors. This we're not going to use. This is the tea tree and the... Oh, actually, we are going to use. Because I said that for the dirt, I'm going to use this for some of the dirt in there because it doesn't get soily and it grows and I could stretch it and play with it so that's going to be our dirt once I add water it comes to life that growing dirt so yep yeah, that will be but we're not going to use the chia seeds or the petri dishes so we could take that up we'll move that And I use better glue, so I these thingies. So I'll put that stuff out of here. Be easier to keep it. This is what I'm going to show you. So. 
right. So we'll add that stuff to the kit. And that can go back to the box so it doesn't get broken. And these are what if you were questioning when you said there's no birds. There are birds. That's the roof. Those were rugs. We don't want, we're not using that rug, right, Cheddar? No. Right. So just the roof. I'm going to get a green string for the tire. And then this will be our owl and our squirrel. That will go on to the bark. And then those we're not going to use. These are supposed to go on the wood tables. I'm not going to use those. I'm just going to keep them wood. And then these stickers are what we're talking about for the birds. There's our birds. Oops, so clear. <clears throat> so all these birds up in here, they're puffy stickers and they're pretty sturdy, but I'm going to reinforce them with a little toothpick and then put something on the back. So this way then I can use the toothpick to stick up into the tree and it will hold better. So we'll use those birds, the butterfly, the bee, the ladybug, the tire swing. And then these little things, I don't know if we're using those yet or not, depending. But these little things, they'll go on the grass or the rocks or whatever. But So that's where our birds will be. And that makes the... um. That's how I'm fitting it, I think, too, with the birds up in there and the animals hiding. Let me drop that. So I think that's it. For the most part, we just peacock was too impossible. We left that out. Um, I think pretty much we, we nailed it, guys. What do you guys think? Yeah. So, once I get the last bit ordered and it's here, then we'll start working on it. We'll start putting it together. Uh, I'll work on getting the plexiglass base um, cut, so that will be ready. She's right down the street. I just got to give her a hug, and she'll give she'll cut that for me. So, and so, yep. And then rabbits. So, Miss Cammy just sent another donation. Anybody that has it and wants to. Like I said, a dollar goes a long way and will get you to be able to be part of the gift. Um, if you want to private email me, if it's, you know, you don't want to say anything or ask in the chat. Um, but email me if you have a concern or a reason um, and we'll go from there. But like I said, those little pigs, they were 89 cents. So if you're, you know, able to, Send a dollar, let me know, and then at the end we'll figure out where the names are going to go. But thank you to those that have sent donations into it. Thank you for keeping it a secret. Um, I think he's going to be surprised. I'm filling out a job application. Uh, oh, online. Oh, I thought you were, we fill an application for the farm. <laughs> Lisa. Um, so yeah, basically we're going to start working on this as soon as I get the last things. I get, I'll work on that this week or so to get the board ready. I'll get that order in and Z, I guess we could start working on it if we don't have the extra person yet. Cause that I can do. And the little things. So probably two weeks, we'll say not this one coming. Let me look at the calendar. I don't even know. Today's the 18th, right? I think so. Yep. Yeah. All right. So two weeks is September 1st, which is the deadline to the cookbook. So September 1st. And I have to ask Robbie what day he's switching in September. So right now, Fridays will still be 
next Friday, and I'm guessing September 1st, Friday. Um, volume so I can hear you. Oh, hi, Dan. Uh, and then sometime in September, Robbie's switching back from Sundays to Fridays. So that means I'm going back to Sundays. So but that doesn't really matter, whatever we switch. But either we'll start September 1st, we can start getting things built and together, or the 8th. I'm probably, actually, I'll probably shoot for the 8th because I have to get the other stuff to come in. So I'm going to place that order, and that order should come, well, they come in fast. That'll give me the two weeks to prepare, get everything else, get the board. And the order in. And then September 8th, we'll start working on them, putting it to life. End of September. Well, yeah, well, that September 8th, we can start and we'll go from there. That will give us all of September, all of October. So if we're missing something and need to play around with it, it'll run into a hiccup, then we'll have enough time and get it done right. I think that sounds good, guys, right? Mm -hmm. Peggy? Yep. So. Yep, today's August 18th. Would have been mine and David's 23rd year today. Oh. Mm -hmm. Well, I'd like to say happy anniversary. Thank you. I, mean, I was just about to say that. Happy anniversary. Lots and lots of hugs. Yes, we love you. He's celebrating with you. Just not in the same spot, but he is. And he's watching over you. And Dan's having strawberries, I bet. But we love you, Shadow. We love all y'all. Yes, we do. Mm -hmm. So. Ooh, well, we made two hours, guys. Thank you. Okay. That worked out. I even, I even not told Zoli. Oh, good, Patty. Zoli doesn't even know. See? Ooh. <laughs> awesome, Patty. So, yeah. Email me thoughts of things, or as I'm doing it, you know, it's going to come to life right in front of you guys. Thank you, Kimberly um, Mills. Good night. Kim. Back. Mm -hmm. So, you guys get your thoughts and things together. Um, I'll work on the last part of it. We'll build it together. We'll have fun together. Oh, thank you for being here. Good night, everybody. Good night, everybody. There we go. So we'll see you on Sunday and get Swamp's live auction. Good night. Oh, okay, Pet. Well, I appreciate that. Because it is a surprise for both of them. So I don't think he'll get mad at that. Thank you, Mouse. Good night, all.